you doing? It's cold in here. I'm not cold. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm taking the couch out. <laughs> Out. Mm -hmm. Now I gotta fit it through that door. I definitely didn't get the couch out at this point. There were a ton of nuts and bolts that were wrapped around the frame of the couch and it was all around the uh, water system. So it was, it was torture getting this thing out. It took a lot longer than it looks here. But once I started getting out one piece, it got a little easier and then I got out another piece and it got a little easier. So not too bad for a low IQ human like me. Couch cam. This is what it's like to be a couch getting carried out of an RV by a hot tattooed chick yeah that was my hands the whole time and this was you the whole time with the heater on your butt i was making sure the heater stayed on all right so all we're gonna do is we're gonna build like a box around all this water stuff and then i'll have access to it and then we're gonna do a desk on top and that'll be it so we got the couch out it's definitely a pain in the ass doing it in the freezing cold but it's out um so i took out this chair mm -hmm. and we realized that the desk shouldn't go here yeah. Because there's nowhere to put your feet because I gotta build a box around this. Yeah. So we're just gonna build a couch, like a new couch here. And then the desk is gonna go right. All right, so the camera stopped. But so <laughs> the desk is gonna go right here. That way you can work from here, you know? Mm -hmm. You can work, or we can eat dinner there. Or you can work from here, and it'll be a bigger desk. And then also when we wanna cook or when we wanna eat dinner, we still have it. And then. Um, so I figured out where the shore power line was and I drilled up through that hole right there so I can get an outlet so we can just plug our Jackery battery right in. And I figured out that our Jackery battery charges in an hour and a half. So all we'd have to do is go into Starbucks and charge it for like an hour and a half and we're at a thousand watts again, which would last us like three days or two mm -hmm. days probably. Or we get solar panels on the roof and check it out. I could run it from the roof straight through, straight through, straight through, and it's just trickle charging the battery all the time, yep. which might be more of a move. So all we gotta do is rip out the carpet, build a box, do the floor, build a desk. Oh, and paint everything first. Yeah. But yeah, easy, easy peasy. It was not easy peasy. As soon as we put on the first coat, we realized this was anything but easy peasy. It was hardy farty. We didn't sand or uh, scrape off any of the old paint or wallpaper. We just painted over it so our first coat was really light. Look at this. You always yell at me for not cutting my nails, but look at that. <laughs> look at that. Look how useful that is. <laughs> my talons. We had to do like three coats of the white because of the wallpaper behind it and the cabinets. Well, you did. Yeah, Let's I see. did. <laughs> you were chilling inside. Well, only for the last part because my yeah. hand hurt. Painted. This mirror blue and these cabinets blue. And we gotta take off all the handles. Yeah, we're gonna take all these handles off and spray paint them. Probably silver or black or something, I guess. Yeah, probably silver. Hey. Got a mess going on. So we just gotta do all these little pieces. Alright, back to work. <laughs> <Just kidding>. huh? <laughs> hey, this is Steph. This is the only part of the video that matters because it's what I did. Um, I soaked the handles from the cabinets in mineral spirits overnight and it got most of the paint off which worked really good. After that I let them dry and once they were completely dry I spray painted them with a silver metallic spray paint and then I screwed them back on the cabinets and voila they're gorgeous. Yeah this works good. Let's see what's under there. Yeah I am curious. It should just be wood. Oh it's just got like a little piece of foam but it's just uh yeah, it's just like shitty wood. Check up on me in like 10 minutes and see how much I got done. <laughs> okay. This video was taken exactly 69 hours later. The carpet was, of course, brutal to take out. Every little corner was a nightmare. I had to cut a million different pieces out for the bathroom because there's so many different uh, angles to cut out. But we powered through. We got it done. My knuckles were bleeding. Here's me almost losing an eyeball with a grinder to this bolt. Uh, once I got the carpet out, I saw all the bolts sticking out from the old furniture and I eventually switched to a jigsaw and got this one bolt out, but the other two are still in right now because it just took hours to get out. First piece. <laughs> the first piece. Make sure it's straight, y'all. You hear that? Yep, it's sticking. That's the sound of a home. Your job is going to be putting your butt cheeks on all these. Here's my bench. You got to put a piece of wood back here and then you're going to do like that. Yep. <laughs> it's a deep couch. 
Yep. It'll be nice. You just need like a really big like back like body pillow. And then here, check out the floor. Even though it's a mess, the floor Still. is done. Here, I'm gonna try I gotta to do the molding bustling. and trim around the edges. So. Oh yeah. And the floor. And we're carpet. Oh no, your poop germs. It looks like a couch. Yeah, <laughs> yeah doesn't it? <laughs> oh yeah. Ah. Yeah, it's freezing. <laughs> <laughs> Why is your breath green? Take it back. <laughs> I'm just good. That's gonna be our couch. This is cutting like butter. <laughs> Don't cut the floor. It's like a cake. It's your birthday cake. I'll eat it. You're gonna be on uh, my strange addiction. Oh yeah, the mattress. Lady mattress. I love that lady. She cool. Right. Good job. Here, I'll be it out. Okay. <laughs> so buff. Yeah, it's cool. It's like another bed. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it is. <sighs> That's cool. For when you're mad at me. So we ended up losing the footage of us making the covers for the couches because I got a new phone. Um, but all there was left to do was install the solar panels on the roof and then make the cushion covers and put everything together. And we were done. That was so much work. You can see my hands were totally destroyed from uh, building this RV. But the floor is great. The paint's great. It feels way more comfortable to live in now. This video was filmed four months ago. And there's tons of more projects that we want to do with the RV. But we're happy with what we did do it so far and we're just happy to be on the road. Thanks again for watching. This is 69 Everywhere. We hope you guys 69 Everywhere. That was disgusting. <laughs>